Tens of thousands of Hoosiers are still filing first-time claims for unemployment. Today, the Labor Department announced that more than 30,000 Hoosiers filed for unemployment benefits last week. The department also revised the previous week's number, decreasing it slightly to just more than 42,000 people who filed for unemployment then. In the eight weeks since businesses started cutting back, more than 650,000 Hoosiers have filed for unemployment. And all those claims are causing a delay in processing for some Hoosiers who say they filed for unemployment back in March but still have not received their benefits. It is an issue we've been following for weeks and we're still working to get answers for those waiting on their money. RTV6's Megan St. Torm spoke with one man who says he's not sure where else to turn. The unemployment benefits process has not been easy for Richard Clark. I filed on March 29th and you know, I waited and waited. And now, more than six weeks later, he's still waiting. They keep saying, we'll call you, we'll call you. Well, I'm waiting. My phone is on 24-7. Clark tells us he worked as a driver for Enterprise, but was laid off due to COVID-19. Now he's relying on unemployment benefits to get by, but so far, he hasn't seen a dime. I'm just wondering, when I'm going to start getting some money in. I mean, it's pretty hard going to the grocery store and not having any money to, to pay for it with. He tells us his online portal shows an issue with deductible income and a claims investigator is supposed to call him. Sometimes I never get a call back. And then when I do get a call back a couple of days later or maybe early evening, um, they said, we're going to be taking care of that for you. And nothing's nothing is happening. A spokesperson for the Department of Workforce Development tells me they hired an additional 160 people to work the call center. They've also tripled the number of claims investigators, although numbers for how many new hires that includes were not immediately available. Still, many like Clark say they think more needs to be done because he's not sure how much longer he can keep waiting. It's getting down to where, yeah, we need the money to really to get by on. Working for you, Megan Sanctorum, RTV6. And the Department of Workforce Development has directed people experiencing the deductible income error message to a video on their website that explains why. We will have a link to that as part of this story on our website at theindychannel.com.